Students at Rosemead High School protesting today over allegations of improper sexual relationships between a popular teacher and former students. Fox 11's Christina Gonzalez is live at the school with a story you will see only on Fox 11. Christina. Yeah, by most accounts, Eric Burgess was a very popular journalism teacher. He had gone to school here, graduated, come back to teach for many years until 2019. Now, what happened has just been published in an article that has some people here really upset. Watch. A protest at Rosemead High School where students reached out to Fox 11 over their anger at the administration's reaction to a Business Insider come article about popular former journalism teacher Eric Burgess. Here he is on photos from the article who was written by one of his former students. I wouldn't say it was easy. It was incredibly difficult. He started his research years ago after a guard at the school supposedly found the then 46-year-old teacher having sex with an 18-year-old who'd been his student a few weeks prior. Matt Drange says there's more. I've confirmed um, three um, former students that, that he had relationships with. In the case of two women, it was immediately after they graduated, um, they told me. Um, so, you know, a matter of weeks after they graduated. In the case of one woman, it was while she was still a student and 16 years old. School officials referred us to the El Monte Union High School District, which in a statement wrote, quote, they took prompt action when it was made aware of the allegations in 2019 and removed the subject teacher from the classroom and conducted a thorough investigation. School officials notified authorities and say they removed Burgess from permanent district employment within 24 hours, but current principal Brian Bristol um, was made aware uh, of allegations that um, I found to be true um, in 2018. So for the district superintendent to say they took action in 2019, a year later, that's a year that, that went by where um, Eric Burgess was still in the classroom, still around children. We're here to show that students have high expectations for our treatment and safety. A large number of students joined the protest during lunchtime, while former students wanting to remain anonymous spoke outside. It's definitely an accurate depiction of what occurred when I was here. And still and continuing. She refers to Rosemead track coach Fidel Dominguez, who was sentenced to three years in 2019 after pleading no contest to sex crimes with a 15-year-old student. The students today are saying... That's why we had this protest today. We want to symbolize that we're tired. We want the school to be more transparent and not, um, you know, conceal this and hide what has been, um, what has been done. Enough is enough and that we want change. We just want new things to come. We have tried to reach out to Burgess so far, no answer. Live at Rosemead, I'm Christina Gonzalez, Fox 11 News. Amazing to hear from those students, Christina, thank you.